Thank you, Mr. President and members. I rise to ask the Senate to adjourn in memory of Mal Bernstein, Malcolm Bernstein, who is a friend, a longtime Berkeley resident, an activist attorney, who is known as the lawyer for the free speech movement. Mal is a lifelong advocate for equity and justice. He passed away at home with his fam family and friends on March 6th, and he was 89. Mal was born in Detroit, Michigan, but he fell in love with the Bay Area when he came to attend UC Berkeley Law School in 1955. After graduating law school and passing the bar, Mal became a central figure in the Bay Area activist movements during the 50s and the 60s. In the 50s, Mal worked on fair housing with CORE, the NAACP, and the Ad Hoc Committee to End Discrimination. In the 60s, Mal became active in the National Lawyers Guild and was the lead attorney for students and others who were arrested in UC Berkeley's free speech movement. Steve and Linda Lustig were students at Cal during that time, and they were arrested at the FSM. It was Mal who bailed them out and then served, and he had never met them before, and then served as their and other FSM arrestees attorney. Steve, Linda, and Mal remained lifelong friends. Later, Steve became the vice chancellor of the very university that got him arrested and Mal, a well-respected alum. A lifelong peace activist, Mal was also the trial attorney for the Oakland Seven, who were charged with felony conspiracy for their anti-draft demonstrations at the Oakland Draft Induction Center. He won acquittal for all seven. Now, some of you, some of my colleagues, you've probably met Mal from when he was very, very active in our state Democratic Party. And that activism goes back to the Vietnam War. His electoral work grew out of local involvement opposing the Vietnam War. At that point, the California Democratic Party was supportive of the Vietnam War. Mal ended up being the lead organizer of the Sheer for Congress campaign in 1966, which was the first Democratic congressional campaign that opposed the war in Vietnam. Mal and others in the East Bay, who were dissatisfied by the party's pro-war position, helped establish an alternative progressive electoral organization, just locally. And that local community for new politics, later named many other things, including Berkeley Citizens Action, elected anti-war activist Ron Dellums to Congress in 1967, along with progressive candidates to the Berkeley City Council, and forged alliances between the peace movement and the Black Panther Party. Years later, in the 2000s, and this is where some of you have may met Mal, Mal was instrumental in organizing our state Democratic Party's Progressive Caucus. He also served as campaign treasurer and advisor for Congresswoman Barbara Lee. Mal mixed his passion for peace and justice with a deep love of family and friends, art, theater, travel, music, hiking with his dogs in our nearby Tilden Park, and coaching his daughter's softball team in elementary and middle school. Mal is survived by his wife, Catherine Trimber, his two daughters, his four grandchildren, and numerous other loving family and friends. He will be missed. Thank you.